uh, today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the 15 piece members mark heavy gauge hard anodized non-stick cookware set really pretty and me and my uh, boyfriend were going around in the stores and we're looking for a good cooking set that i could use to start my channel and so we saw this one and we were like this is really pretty we tried out um martha stewart we tried rachel ray we saw the reviews online and we're like oh we're a little iffy about it people were like oh it's not really that nice some people were like it when you cook the bottom scratches a lot people were like, i mean there was like really bad reviews so I was like, you know what, let's just try Members Mark. I love Sam's Club. Disclaimer, this is not a video about um, Members Mark or Sam's Club products. There are no way um, funding this. This is just me picking a pot set that I like and starting off my videos with something that I think would be awesome. So it looks like there's a bunch of stuff with it. There's a three quart um, saucepan. There's um, two quart saucepans, eight inch saucepans. There's just a lot of saucepans and um, some, well, I think most of them are covered. So I was looking for something because I'm someone who cooks a lot of soups, stews, Nigerian food. I mean, being in America, I also cook American food too, but mostly I wanted something that was multi-purpose. I mean, everybody wants a good saucepan. They can use the fried eggs and it won't burn. Non-stick on these pots look really good. All right, I'm gonna start unboxing what's inside. It wasn't, it didn't have any tape on it. It was pretty good. Oh! We can take out that part. <laughs> this looks like a really deep dish kind of saucepan. Honestly, the outside is really like rustic it's a very nice i don't even know i guess that's what the anodized or whatever i don't even know what an anodized is but this feels amazing then inside it's a little grainy so i don't know but we'll see when we do another video with like cooking and stuff but for now the aesthetics are quite nice Alrighty. there's way too much packaging save the plants we have another saucepan. This is a bigger one. Um, really cute. The same beautiful rustic outside and deep, deep. I love deep dishes. I mean, except for like, you know, trying to use a bigger pot, you can use just this, so like bulk of rice, small spaghetti for one <laughs> here by yourself. I think it's packaged where it's like smaller, medium, bigger. So. That's pretty cool. Way too much packaging, honestly. But I guess it means just to keep it comfortable. Okay, so we got a bigger pan. This is amazing. I love this. I love this size. This is deep. I mean, there's many things you can make with this. It's also a very quick spaghetti. On the back, I never showed y'all what it says on the back. It says hard, atomized, non-stick. Professional quality. So that's a four quart. So four quarts of water and whatever the heck you're making. Soup, I don't know, but it's really pretty. Look at that. That's gorgeous. Honestly, the packaging is crazy. But I guess that's just to keep them from scratching. The this is probably gonna be a pot I use all the time because I'm a family person, so I'm always cooking big dishes, and I love this. So this is the perfect size for me if I wanna make rice, beans, quick deep dish, um, zucchini pasta or something, I have no idea. But it's very beautiful. So heavy. Now we're getting into the saucepans. This is the time when it gets personal. No, okay, we're just gonna use a knife because it's getting out of here. If anybody told me I'd become a butcher right now. Ah, shoo, never mind. Well, dang, that's a big A saucepan. Honestly, 
You can just find me the cutest frittata, like the big sun-dried tomatoes on top, so yummy. Yes, my calculations are right. The 12 inch saucepan. So beautiful, isn't that? Look at that, that's beautiful. That's our 12 inch saucepan. This is the 10 inch. It's actually, you know, come on y'all. 12 and 10, is that, does that look accurate? Okay, well. The cute little baby eight inch, if you wanna make a cute, simple, um, sunny side up omelet or something. That's a beautiful, smooth, the inside, it's very thick and very heavy, honestly. This is much bigger than my head. Woo, look at that. That is a big, big cover. 5.5 quart. It's basically 5.2 liters, y'all. You can literally make a dip dish pizza stop. Oh my goodness. The ideas are just flowing in, I'm sorry. This could be perfect for a deep dish pizza. And it's 5.5 quarts. Alrighty, I love that. I can find space to put it somewhere. One more big pot. We have more covers, more crap, and more trash, and more crap, and more trash. <laughs> this might go stuck here. This might go stuck here. I don't know. And last but not the least, we have our deep boiling pot, the eight quart, 7.6 liters and eight quarts of delicious fluids. Soup, gumbo, if you're a gumbo person who doesn't like using a crock pot, a slow cook gumbo, slow cook um, Cajun rice, I mean, boil something that's a little bit more bigger like um, a whole hen, or a whole chicken. I mean, this can do everything. It's pretty deep. If you're looking for a bigger, much, I mean, compared to my hand, my head, I don't know. But it's, <laughs> it's pretty big, pretty deep, pretty lovely. Alrighty. So those are all the beautiful collections that we have. I love the color, I would say that. I love the texture, and I love the stainless steel feel. It is recommended to wash by hand and not in a um, dishwasher, which I already do. I do not use a dishwasher. I only hand wash all my things. But if you're somebody who uses it, I mean, this is um, pretty hard material. I don't know what it would do long term, but um, I read a lot of reviews on this specific brand and um, this specific amount of um, items. And I got a lot of good reviews. A lot of people said that um, it doesn't scratch as easily. Um, I didn't see a lot of stuff about dishwashers because I don't need dishwashers. So um, I, didn't, I didn't really look at that. But um, I like it. I think it's really nice. Um, I will be doing a video soon, cooking with all these beautiful instruments and it will be up soon. Alrighty, so this is a quick review on these amazing instruments I just bought. Um, I love each pot. I think they're all going to be very, um, very, very useful. I feel like it was a great deal. Under $200 was perfect for me, or is perfect for me. And I'm going to be doing more videos in the future, coming very soon, on um, what I'm going to be using these uh, instruments to do, uh, how I use them, how I clean them, what I'm going to be cooking. And there'll be so much more content on you know, how it works out. And I feel like these are really durable and will be perfect for a family or a single person who doesn't want, well, probably for a single person is a little, a lot, but I feel like for a family, this is perfect. It has 
a lot of saucepans you can use in the morning, things for um, soups and, and deep dishes and boiling some heavy duty stuff. So don't forget to like, subscribe and comment uh, if you enjoyed this content and I'll be bringing you much more very soon. Thank you so much.